Welcome back to episode 7 of my Paragon Top 5 Fails. If you have any awesome clips you wish to submit, send them to www.paragooners.com. A link will be in the description below. Having just wiped the enemy team, Staring Clouds and his allies decide to do the Orb Prime. Only the Orb Prime proves to be a bit stronger than they anticipated, with Staring Clouds dying, followed by Greystone and eventually Gideon. Meanwhile, the enemy team have respawned and now have a free Orb Prime. Hanky Zets on Grux is getting collapsed in on by the enemy team. He manages to find a way out by blinking up towards the red buff, but Murdoch completely blocks him, essentially assisting the enemy in killing his own teammate. Three. Tree 3 on Kwong and his teammate on fire are ganking an Iggy where things go from good to just straight up embarrassing. Grux lands a fantastic pull, but the root, thanks to Kwong's sword, manages to keep Iggy out of harm's way. Two. Marty Rivia is a fantastic player, easily the best support in the game, but we all have those moments where we just fail to land a shot, and that's exactly what happens. Shadon manages to juke Marty left and right. Walking as close to Marty as possible, he makes it so much harder for him to land a shot. Even using the cover of the shadow pad to live for so long, eventually Marty manages to kill him. Rex, you have red tie and help him in the back. Melis Mortem and his two allies attempt to invade the enemy's red buff. They charge straight at Murdoch and Kwong, but a minion wave appears just in time. Melis Mortem goes down so quickly thanks to the Winions, while Chimera almost manages to get Murdoch, but dives a tier 2 tower and gets obliterated. Meanwhile, Kwong kills Rampage, also thanks to the help of the Winions. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the community's top 5 fails. Smash that thumbs up button if you did, and remember to submit any fails you have to W www.paragooners.com and I'll see you guys soon.